Welcome back to Upper Michigan today, everybody. We're live at Aquapotics in Marquette, but actually inside of this business is another business that complements what's offered with the float therapy pod tank. We're here with Lindsay White. She's a certified Reiki practitioner of Ruled by the Sun. So thanks a lot for joining us on our program. How is what? How does what you offer complement what uh, Peter and Leo offer with the float tanks? Well, Reiki helps move any stagnant energy we may hold in the body, so it also releases toxins. So that's what the pod does, so it helps complement that process of releasing any toxins or negative emotions or stress that we may hold in the body. And how did you come to get into this practice, and like, how did you find your path here? I've always been drawn to spirituality. I never thought I'd be in business with this, so coming up here kind of opened that world to me because there actually is Reiki practitioners up here. People know about it up here. So that's what kind of led me to this. I met a Reiki practitioner up here, and she showed me who trained her. So I've been, I'm in my master's right now um, at Golden Light Healing in Green Bay. So just seeing where it takes me. Yeah. yeah. For those that don't know, what is Reiki? Reiki is an energy healing modality for stress reduction, relaxation, and it also promotes self-healing and balance and harmony in the body. So is it about aligning your chakras? I see the yeah. seven chakras on yeah, the board. It's so it's very similar to chiropractors, pretty much, but it's aligning you energetically. Um, so when helps. someone comes in, um, Tia, you want to lay down? I can, I can lay down. Okay, let's pretend like Tia came in. This is you her want first. Me to fall asleep. Well, yeah, I do. I always try to get you to fall asleep on the show, which is not hard to do. Okay, so she, you know, she just kind of lays in. Mm -hmm. What is, what does the session kind of look like? Just to give our viewers a sense of what a session with you. You don't have to do it with her, yeah. but you know, are you kind of feeling her energy, yeah. touching her? Reiki is activated by intention, so it's a form of meditation. So I have my eyes closed for the most part, and I'm just visualizing a light going through your body and it will melt away. It goes wherever it's needed. It will melt away any stress or any negative emotions that you may hold in your body. So I like to do a light massage on the head and shoulders and hands with some oils to kind of just enhance the experience. And I also will do some sound bowl healing as well, ah. which will, I'm so shaky right now because I'm, <laughs> I'm not gonna do it because I'm shaky because I'm on camera, but it's a very relaxing experience. You mean it doesn't usually sound like, <laughs> yeah, it's normally very, it's so It's calming. like a dinner bell right now because you're so nervous. <laughs> yeah, but yeah, so yeah. And it's kind of like the an exchange of energy between you and. It's not, yeah, it's not like my energy because I'm not healing you or anything like that. It's like kind of channeling like God's energy. Like the scientists measured what's happening on an energetic level and the light is coming from above through my body out of my hands to you going wherever it is needed. So I kind of try to not put my energy into sure. it. It's more of like whatever you need, whatever, like, cause you're here, brought here for a reason. Yeah, so. yeah. And so because of that, it's like a really personal experience yeah. between you and whoever's laying down on, on this table. Yep. <laughs> so. How does one book a session with you, and, and how long does the session last, and, and what's, what does that look like? You could do a bundle, which I recommend because it's the best service, I feel like, it's, which is a 30-minute Reiki session and then an hour float. But you can also book an hour session with me as well. So okay. we could do 30 minutes or an hour, and they're both very relaxing, I would recommend. Trying both. Sure. Just trying it sure. out. Is this something that you recommend people do regularly in their life or, you know, once every three months or, or what? It's when every two weeks, every month is great. Same with the pod. Um, it's very, it's just very relaxing. It's yeah. always going to be beneficial. Every, I do it every day. I always encourage clients to practice self-reiki on yourself, practice meditating every day, especially when you're a very busy or stressed individual because it's even more important to have that. And it's, it's interesting to, when you can start to, like, feel things are off, right? Yeah. To then be able to, like, put some energy toward different mm -hmm. places. Yeah. I mean, we're going into the summer months. I feel like this is a really busy time for everybody. Got my dance recital next Sunday. <laughs> got my softball game the Sunday after that. And after that, and, and of course, you're going to have health to worry Gosh. about. So <laughs> I feel like it's just one of those things that it's nice to take the time for yourself when you're feeling that overwhelmness from the hustle and bustle of it all. Yeah. 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 Well, I think this is great, and I'm excited for you. And uh, we'll have to check back in once you make How much longer do you have before you get through your master's class? Um, well, I'm doing level two as an apprentice June 15th. So the next, the master class, I'll go as an apprentice whenever the next one's available. Okay. So this year, so I'll probably be Fantastic. finished this year. Oh, well, that's exciting. That is exciting. All right. Well, um, what segment are we in? We've got a couple left. You've got are you getting in the pod? 
I could. I brought my swimming suit. Of course you did. She brings her swimming suit to every episode just in case. Just in case. If there's water involved, <laughs> yeah. That's right. That's right. We'll take a break, and uh, we have much more for you when we come back. <laughs>